Drake's the best ever? Please. I agree. We are back live from the uh, Rob City Drake's Diddy Coco, DJ hey. D Love on the ones and twos, man. Yes, we got our guest of the hour in the building, man. For the second time, we get to actually talk to you. But the first time in the Hub Radio, yes, good music we producer, man. Yeah, we, we, you know, it took us some time. I don't want to act like we was celebrity late, but it was just <laughs> when you get someone to address with a half in it. It's oh hard. yeah, it's just yeah. that difficult. Hey man, Especially I was when you dealing with high, you know high school job prize. I was so trying you to. Gotta, you gotta be exact. I was trying to pronounce your last name, bro. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm still working. I'm still working on it. Okay, can can my you say it for me one more time? My father say it's Kafaf. So Kafaf. I'm gonna I'm go with what he said. All right. So. All right, man. So Why don't I get earphones like y'all? You know what? I figured you didn't now, need them. You know, you know, you know, we have plenty of headphones for you. Know? Yeah, we can get you some headphones. Okay. We can so get an endorsement or No, nah, yeah. Y'all, see, y'all. We, mine, you know, we got buds. Yeah. We, ain't, we, ain't, we ain't endorsed yet, so hey, we just got the buds. Why is it got a lot of money? <laughs> so, man, how, how you been, bro? Really good, man. Yeah. Really, really good. Now, uh. So blessed. So, feeling great. I wanted to talk to you about your whole your whole history. Just, you know what I'm saying? Because we, we talked briefly at the BT uh, weekend. Uh, we got a chance to chop it up briefly, but like I want to know your history, man. Like where you come from, and you know how you how you come into producing. Uh, I, I know originally you're from Africa, right? Uh, uh, the continent well, of Africa. Well, I, I guess we all technically are from Africa. Okay. Um, but uh, my father, my father was born in Iraq, um, Baghdad, Iraq, which was Babylon, which was Mesopotamia, which is the first civilization. So, um, and and technically the Middle East is technically Africa because there was no divide until they made a man-made river to separate them because they didn't want the Holy Land to be in Africa and they didn't want Jesus to be <laughs> from Africa. So, that's but right. that's another conversation. But, uh, so, yeah, so my, that, my dad um, and my grandfather was actually in the parliament Free Saddam Hussein, uh-huh. and um, when Saddam Hussein came in as a dictator, uh, they cut my grandfather's head off. And, and um, yeah. So okay. Being so from that. your birth, because that was about since you were yeah. born, uh, can you like skip like yeah. twenty some years? Yeah. So then I just started liking porn and Hype Williams videos, and then I was just like, okay, cool, let's just do rap. <laughs> no, really, what what influenced you start uh, making music? The the first time. Um, well, I would think I was one years old in the baby chair listening to Poison. The and Bell Biv DeVoe. Yeah. Hey, yeah. yeah, girl, is yeah. Which sums up my whole life now. The whole time. Like, <laughs> never trust a never trust big booty and a smile. You know what I'm saying? It's been falling for it ever since. Whole, and, ever since. Like, but, um, so that was like the first thing. And then when I was eight years old, I saw the Puff Daddy Mace video. With the shiny suits. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. More money, more problems. Care. I didn't care about the Diana Ross sample. I didn't care about the raps. I didn't care about the beats. I cared about the shiny suits, the and Jesus I, Peace chains, and, and the light skinned girls in the video. <laughs> so that's I a, said, man, that's, that's that it. That was the monster that, in that you. That was it, man. I said, how do we do that? How do we just, even if we just a water boy, if we Bobby Boucher on, let's just be on set of those things. So, what made you actually start producing, though? Like, when did you, what did you pick up? A keyboard, laptop, how did you get started? Uh, well, I played basketball my whole life, and then um, one semester I got a 0.2 GPA, and I couldn't play basketball no more, so uh, that was right when College Dropout came out, uh, mm-hmm. Kanye's first album, and uh and I was like, man, he's making all these beats, and he said he don't know he don't know how to play any instruments, so maybe I could do that too. So I just uh, my birthday's in December, so I was like, mom, can I get this uh, drum machine? And it, it it would be my birthday present, my Christmas present, <laughs> my New Year. You know what I mean? Groundhogs. I was trying to get right. presents for Groundhogs. <laughs> I was trying to get presents for every holiday. Anything, every holiday. all that. I was like, it's Groundhogs Day. Uh, but so yeah, so I, I got an NPC because I thought that's what would make me a rapper. Mm-hmm. I was like, this is what make me a rapper. And for a year, I just stared at it. I had I no idea how to, how to work it. Or I nothing. didn't know how to press record. I didn't know how to. I didn't know nothing about tempo. Because really, making beats pre computers was very like a mathematical thing. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. it was like you know you're dealing with samples and tempos and 
you know, now with computers it's different, but you know, this is, and I don't want to date myself, but this is pre Fruity Loops. So, uh, you know, I was, I was <laughs> I having to date myself. Yeah, I was figuring out shit, you know, and I'm sitting there in math class with the with the book, the instruction manual inside the math book, like trying to figure it out. So, yeah, that was that was the and then that was the birth of it. Yeah. So now, do you remember the first uh, actual track that you produced? Like not, not that actually came out. Yeah. But do you remember making your first beat? Oh, my first beat was one of the best beats I ever made. Do Do we know it now? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where it's at, but it was one of the best beats amazing. you ever made. And I ain't used no sample or nothing. I can't even think about making a beat without a sample now. But I somehow made a beat without a sample, and that it was a really good beat. Bro, it was really dope. Okay, so what was your first track that actually got put out? Uh, it was a beat called uh, for Cameron, who's my favorite rapper of all time. Uh, I thought Kanye was your favorite. No, no, Kanye's. Ka- I don't even think Kanye's a good rapper. I think <laughs> Kanye is. I think Kanye is one of the greatest people to walk the earth, like Jesus, Tupac. But I think Tupac and Kanye are one of the worst rappers ever. But I think Tupac and wow. Kanye are some of the greatest people to ever live. But rappers, like, just cool as fuck and, mm-hmm. like, could get bitches regardless. Like, Cam, Chris Brown, Fabulous. Uh, Chris Breezy. Oh, Chris Breezy. Yeah, Rocky, ASAP Rocky. There's certain people that's just, like, regardless if they have money or not, they, they gonna fuck bitches. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's the whole motive. Yeah, like, they... <laughs> but, like, a lot of these people, they just cool because of, like, the art. And that's, like, me. Like, we're really just nerds mm-hmm. that get to say we're artists now. <laughs> and, like, it's like, oh, cool. So, why do you feel like Kanye, though, is a bad rapper? No, no, see, hold on. Wait. We, it, I, don't, it, I don't think he's a bad rapper. I think that... Uh, I think I'm a bad rapper. Like, it's not about... It's not about... It's not about rapping or technicality. You know what I mean? It's about emotions and feelings and... You know, like people say, Donald Trump's not a politician. He's a businessman. Well, America's a business. So what the fuck? Like, why Why are we so caught up in, like, the, uh, the semantics of things? Like, I don't know anything about music. But, you know, I be putting together, in my opinion, uh, you know, art pieces that, you know, you can, whatever, whatever it is that, you want to distinguish it as or put it in a box it's like you know but i look at it more as current events like when you used to have to make current event projects in class and you cut out stuff in the newspaper and glue it that's what i do i glue stuff from newspapers and put it on to my own piece of paper okay it don't got nothing to do with music it has to do with feelings and conversation that's why i like this more than i like studios Mm -hmm. because i like to talk and have conversation anyone who knows me if you come to the studio with me you might sit there for hours and just talk. And there's no music playing. Because how are we supposed to make music if we don't have conversation first? You know, and, and figure out what's going on. I can dig that. Like Marvin Gaye. What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> I can dig that. Now, look. Earlier, you I had posted. This? You got auto on this? No. No, we don't got no auto tune, my brother. <laughs> look. Come on, y'all. You got to laugh. You know what I'm saying? Earlier, we had um, put a joke. post up, bro, uh, of the best diss tracks that we had. Listed uh, that we had listed, so I'm gonna ask you. I want you to put them in order for you. Um, it was Tupac, hit him up. Uh, Ice Cube, no Vaseline. Uh, uh, what else was Biggie, it? Biggie, who shot, you? who shot you? Ether. Ah, uh, there we go, right there. Who shot you? Ether, take over, hit him up, no Vaseline. Okay. So, uh, no, okay. don't, don't put it in order right. now. We're gonna take a break. Okay. We're gonna take a, we're gonna take a break. Uh, DJ D Love's gonna take us uh, on a break real quick. We'll be right back. Then you can put them in order. Okay. Uh, radio. We've had, we've had those yeah, before. You know? uh, yeah, we've had that we've before. Had. But you know, um, okay, well, Donald, Donald Trump's supposed to be trying to ban porn, though. You know that, right? <laughs> you a liar. No, no I just said just talk about it on my taste of time. Nah, don't make me not. I like Trump, man. Look, do that. he yeah. said if he's elected president that he is going to ban porn from the internet. This now how guy. you feel. Now, wait a minute. Now, now, now how you feel. Your God, Where's son. the stat? Where's the stat at? <laughs> It's online. It, 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 he signed a pledge to anti-pornography group. Enough is enough. 
fact. Actually, okay? you know what though? It would actually make it more. Uh, it would actually help the porn game. Now you, now you agree. No, well, you just because you like Trump, <laughs> now, now you agree. No, 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 no. How you no, no, no. I think, right. No, I think the banning of it would actually make it. Um, I think it would actually. Actually, that's dope. Maybe this is a master plan. Yo, Donald is the goat. Wow. Oh, no, look, 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 see how, see how no, fast you flip? Watch. Uh-uh. He bans it, and now it becomes like, remember when the Jordan, the first Jordans got banned? Do you remember that? Come yeah, on, I stop it. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. Yeah, I don't remember. Who, where's the culture at? Let's get somebody, let's get somebody who understands the, the first Jordans got banned because in the NBA, yeah, yeah, your yeah, shoes yeah, could only be two right. colors. And the Jordan ones were the first shoe that was three colors. And they was like, yo, if you wear these, you're going to get fined 50000 every game. And guess what Nike said? Wear them. We got to pay for it. <laughs> As, that's yeah, what's 50 grand to a motherfucker like me for real? And, 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 every game, though. You're willing to pay that for 82 game, games? And, and they, and, and, but that's what they had a to lot do. Of they, they put that bread on the line, and now it went from people being like, what's that brand, Nike, to Nike. Yeah. When Jordan signed, he was like, I don't know if I want to do the deal with Nike. He called it Nike. He didn't even know. It was Nike. Yeah. That's the, all right. He wanted, to sign, with, he wanted to sign with Converse. Because Magic Johnson was with Converse. Right. Julius right. Irvin, Larry Bird, everybody. If you wasn't with Converse, you was like trash. That was the first basketball shoot. So he got so he got banned. So, I, so maybe he bans it. And then it, it, it raises the quality up. Because I do actually, one of my goals in life is to direct a beautiful like Stanley Kubrick looking porn. I think lighting, like there, I think someone could really kill it. Like they could really light it and make it like a beautiful. Um, it's serious too, right? Now. No, the desert. All right, yeah. listen, man, put this in order for me, man. We gotta we, yeah. go with the, We gotta hit them up. Ether, take okay, over. Okay, well, it, no it's man. atrocious What's that my man Aubrey is not in here because. <laughs> He got nominated for a Grammy Coco for a back to back, and he disrespected the only street rapper that's still somewhat relevant, and uh, and and he did it, and he did it as oh yeah, the Hotline uh, Bling the Man, the only street rapper. I mean, who, who, right, who, who else? Who else we got? It's a few of them out there. Man. Let's, let's name you got, one. You got the Ti's. You got your Ti yeah. like ten years ago. You Come got, on, you name got, somebody right now. Uh, Two chains. Yo you got Yo Gotti. You got. Okay, that's for like the, that's you got the real, real street. I'm talking about. I'm talking <laughs> about street, but still like somewhat mainstream. What's wrong with the chains? Yeah, Schoolboy yeah, Q. Schoolboy. Yeah, school school okay, hold on. No, see, he's naming all these LA people. That's like. What's wrong with? Is that? It's LA's like out? no. It's just like they on a they on the. You know not to fuck with them. Yeah, I love. <laughs> I, love, I, love I actually think Schoolboy Q is more of a star than Kendrick. I think Schoolboy is, is a rock star. I fuck with Schoolboy Q way more than Kendrick. What what? I love Schoolboy. What happened? We don't hear it ourselves anymore. Okay. So, I never heard myself because I don't got the buds. But, <laughs> <laughs> but the number one, the number two, and number three is TakeOver. Okay. Jay-Z. Uh, um, oh. Because Kanye produced that also. <laughs> yeah, and and the sample is Jim Morrison, which is the Doors, which is amazing. So that's number one, number two, and number three. And then number four and number five is Biggie, who shot you. <laughs> so there's no Vaseline in that. <laughs> no, there's no, no Vaseline in that. <laughs> Corey is yes. so disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't believe. If, no, if you don't put no Vaseline in this conversation, it's not even a conversation. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna be honest with you. Ice Cube's a great writer. And when he sat in his room, he wrote great fairy tales, but I don't believe him. You. So. So, go, so no Vaseline doesn't and matter. Nas and Ether is one of the most overrated songs of all time. Ether, how okay. you going to say, you guys, <laughs> drink so your lips. It's not like a middle school. If you listen to Ether, it sounds so dated. That's why you don't even perform it no more. It that sounds so dated. How you going to say, I'm a Jay Z fanatic. Play bro, Ether I'm after this and really listen to it as a grown man and, and be like, wow, that was like. Really? That's what you're going to do? <laughs> That's whack, man. Jay, Jay said real things in that. Let's keep, let's keep, uh, you know who, did you know what, will you know who? Let's keep that between me and you for now. That yeah, hurts that, your that, heart, <laughs> Nazir. That hurts your heart. <laughs> <laughs> Dick sucking lips and, and, and HIV and you, I rock hoes, you rock fella. Like, come on, fam. That's a sixth grader line. That's like a sixth grader 
is coming at you with I rock hoes, you rock fellas. Hey, fam, Jay gave you real disrespect. He fucked your baby moms, and you know that because he he named he named the car that she owns, <laughs> and he said that he ejaculated on your on your seeds baby chair. It's disrespect. That's like that's. That was yeah, yeah, spooky. It, it, it was, it Shout was out to Irv Gotti too. On Irv Gotti's my man, and he's the one who gave us Super Ugly. If you go listen to Super Ugly, who knows Super Ugly? Oh okay. yeah, I remember. Super, Super Ugly. Ugly was the real like, you know, gloves off. That's what he said. And even if Ethan did win, so maybe he won the battle, but we know Hove won the war. Ultimately, all right. So look, check this out. Now we we played rapid fire before when you was here. Yeah, and, but I do um, love Nas. <laughs> Just to be clear. <laughs> so look, we got rapid fire. We finna do, man. We um, you already played it before. We got yeah, thirty love seconds. Game. Love his game. It makes my dick hard. Love his game. Whoa. See, uh, yeah, man. You know, it's just hard to ask a question. Come on, baby. We gotta, you know what I'm saying? We gotta keep it live, baby. We live and direct. Hey, uh, you gotta get the ratings up, man. If Donald Trump teaches you one thing, get the ratings up. Listen, man. We. <laughs> Yours time starts after Coco reads her first Let's question. Go. Oh, let me zone in with you. All right. Okay. Let me get my posture right. Tell me when to start. All right. Am I clear? Am I clear on the mic? Am I coming you, in clear? Yes. All right. Yes. I gotta be coming in loud and clear. Three, two, one. Drake or Cameron? Oh my. God. Okay, it's pause. Hold on. You did this last time. All right, but hold on. You hold on. literally had <laughs> 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 it. Either this okay. or that. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. 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 Drake or Cameron? Cameron. Ass or shit? Ass. Sex in the shower or sex in the car? Shower's dangerous because I feel like I'm going to come in or so far. <laughs> Meet a dead celebrity. Uh, Fat ass or big titties? The we said that. Rick James or... Fucking... Let's run it back. No, yeah. 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 no, not we. I I fucked it up. I fucked it up. No, you didn't. You repeated the same question. Yes, he did. I would. You were not saying anything. Y'all don't care about me, man. Y'all don't care about me. We gotta start it up. Okay. One more time. Here we go. Now going whole whole. Now I can't say the same thing. No. We going with whole new batch. We fucked that one up. I fucked that. But you know, in the shower, do be dangerous if you feel like. That's what fucked me up. Cause my god, shit. Don't listen to him. You don't know, cause you don't know. You gotta You got thirty seconds. You gotta answer him quick, man. Now I'm gonna be dead serious. I ain't gonna look at y'all. <laughs> you don't know if you came though in the shower, it's dangerous. You be like, yo, I don't know. For real? Can I start? Let's go, I'm ready. Let's go. I'm okay. Go. Gay son or gay daughter? Gay daughter. Asian food or soul food? Soul food. Pornhub or red tube? Red tube because red bones. Weed or liquor? Neither, I don't do neither. Missionary or doggy style? Doggy, we dog. Go back in history and kill baby Hitler or baby Saddam? Saddam because he killed my grandfather. Smoke or drink? I don't believe it. Would you rather have a kill for cancer or kill for racism? Uh, cancer. Lose your hand or lose your eye? What? Lose your hand or lose your eye? Uh, ooh, hand jacking off, eye soon. Uh, I don't know. Just die. Fat needs a fat elbow. Fat elbow. Fat elbow. Fat needs a fat elbow. He said it's fat Albert. <laughs> Hey, but that wasn't too bad, though, man. You actually did pretty good what this time, the man. Job, the question. I said Fat Albert. I don't yeah. know why you said Smoke or drink, huh? <laughs> yeah, that was damn funny. Okay, hold on. We got to run, too. No I love this game. <laughs> <laughs> you love this game? Hey, you're supposed to. We're supposed to feel some type of way from. Yeah, but he got three chances. <laughs> How many total you got? No, I ran through that one. I know, but I, I know I had ten. Yeah, I got seven. I got five. Eight. Yeah, eight. Yeah, eight. I fucked yeah. with her. Eight. Yeah, yeah thirteen total. Missing. Yeah. Thirteen total. There's no way. We was going back and forth. Seven of them was like. <laughs> all, all from that last thirty seconds? Yeah, 
Yeah. Oh, I, I can't count the, the other name. two. No. no oh, count. okay. okay. Six. Sorry. Yeah. I tried to give you. I tried right? to give you two more. Yeah, eleven, man. But that was way better than you did the first time. The first, first time, time you got like, one. <laughs> so. We were like nipple size penis or penis size nipple. Is that the one you liked that one? No. No. I started talking about eating ass. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Damn that shit. He he takes ass right there. Mmm ass. Hell yeah. So, no, okay, I'm glad you did better on this time, man. Yeah, that was really good. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> so, look, now I know you're pushing your actual, your music now. Yeah. Uh, so, talk to me about, uh, uh, do you have the mixtape that, that, you, that you're coming uh, out with? Or is yeah, it? I'm, uh, yeah, I have, um, actually, the most important thing, September 9th. Okay. We're doing a art gallery show where I'm playing an entire instrumental album with 2001 Space Odyssey, Stanley Kubrick movie. Right. Um, so I'm actually scoring the movie with this no. instrumental album. So there'll be like live installations of things that are in the movie. And um, yeah, so that's, that's like the main that's pretty important dope. thing. Yeah, that's like the... And then and there's that's, some that's, raps. That's September 9th. 9th. And the reason why September 9th is because that date will be 999. And I know you think that it's not, but 2016 is actually six plus two plus one, so it is nine. That's that's. And the reason why nine is important because we have nine holes on the body, you know. It's like um, you're nine months for the baby to be born. You know, nine is important. Okay. So is everybody? Oh, nine songs on Thriller. <laughs> hey. is, is everybody invited to this um, event, or is it something exclusive? Well, if a lot of people don't come, I'm gonna say that it was private. <laughs> but right yeah, for right now, yeah, like yeah. But the problem is, there's no location yet. Okay. So, um, and there probably won't be a location until like the day of. Uh, so it probably will end up being very like low key and like we're just trying to kind of run it for the first time. But the goal is to be able to do it at like LACMA mm -hmm. and like just in the middle of the park. Okay. Like you just at the park and you want to come watch a movie and listen to these beats and you get to just catch a vibe. Because sometimes you just got to take it back to the park. Like, hip-hop is really started out in the park. Like, you got to just go back to the park and let kids and let people enjoy it. Like, it can't be so stressed out. You know what I mean? So I'd you, be, like, so... Are you going to... I'm sorry. Go no, ahead. No, no, good. No, are you going to post it on your um, social media? Yeah. So, okay. So, are you, you are going to invite everybody out then. It's yeah, definitely. It's going to be last minute. Definitely. So, we got to keep up with you. But it's free. It's dope. We have dope merch. The merch is crazy. I'm going to get a lot of... Uh, uh, good feedback from a lot of dope people um, or close to getting like a design done so when okay. we do we'll definitely be posting that and that's going to be like really cool because you know I think I think that's something that uh, I have a pretty good like eye on is like you know what the what the vibe is and what people care about as far as like you know Especially with that movie. If you've ever watched 2001 Space Odyssey, I don't know if you have. Uh, yeah, but, you know, it just connects with everything that's happening right now with Steve Jobs choosing his logo to be the bite out the apple, like Adam and Eve. And, you know, there's this big monolith that looks just like the phone in the movie. And there's just a lot of things that show you that we really haven't evolved at all. Like okay, we, we so think we and, they're, and they're going to show the movie at the on the ninth. Yeah, and that's going to be. Or you don't have a location, but they can follow you on your social yeah. media and we're, find we're, out information. Yep, mm -hmm. and the social media is Hassan. Thank Hassan, God. Hassan, thank God. Hassan, yeah. thank God, man. Uh, and that's not like an e I want to make this clear too. That's not like an egotistical like Hassan. I'm a God thing. No. That's like me worshiping. Like we're just servants, and I'm right. just like the lowest servant possible. So I just want to make that clear because it's never like. Hey, I am this. I am just worshiping at all times. So it's like that. I just want that to be a clear thing. For sure, man. man I, I wouldn't have thought of anything else. But thanks for coming through, my brother. We yeah. surely appreciate it, man. We got to get your signature on this wall. Definitely. Somewhere, we you know, we just, this only our second week. So we still doing some, some stuff, man. But we need your signature on yeah. this wall. Can man. I real quick do like a rap? Absolutely, man. Okay. We're going to acapella, right? Yeah. Okay. It's a super long rap, though. Oh shit. Okay. You have you have all 30 right. seconds. Here you go. She's all body until she's nobody. <laughs> oh, radio, man. We got <laughs> DJ D level of the ones and twos, man. Take us a break real quick. We'll be right back. Huh, radio. Yeah.